Hi, the purpose of this video is to show you the benefits of using Petritus Pro with Petrel. So here we have Petrel 2017. We'll start Petritus Pro from inside of Petrel. And this video is going to concentrate on the benefits of the mapping. There'll be another video which looks at surface modeling. So we start the mapping. Here we have a uh, Petritus Pro map. And what we're going to do is show um, how easy it is to make a map. So we'll just drag and drop some data. So we'll look at a surface, we'll look at some wells, and we'll look at some uh, some 3D seismic bin data. Once we've got the information across into, into Petrosys, we can actually look and change it. So what we're going to do here is we're going to switch off the annotation for that particular horizon. So now we see the data in our Petrosys map, and now we have the power of Petrosys mapping with our patrol data. So to start with, we might want to look at a different template. So a corporate standard template will bring up our regional mapping template. So here we can see we've got our location maps and our, and our title blocks, which if we want to, we can add data to. So here we're gonna add some data. So this is our top target depth. Okay, and if you want to, we can use a different range of different templates and we can sort, store this map. So this is getting the data directly from Petrel. So if we store, save this as a, a new map, so Nathan top target depth, every time we open up that map or refresh that map, anything that we've changed inside of Petrel will be stored in, inside of Petrosis. We can open up a, a more sophisticated map that we've made before so this map shows that you can have groups inside of uh, the Petrosis map so you can have more than one horizon displayed if you want to let me show you how might be, that might become important we can also show that we can actually bring in data from other sources so in this particular case we've got a shape file we might want to bring in uh, kingdom data or excel data or our other arc map data or even z map data we can bring in onto our onto our Petrosis map once we have our map inside of Petrosys, we can then make a variety of different hard copy formats from it. So we can see here, we can save it as a PDF. So write this to a PDF file. And once it's open inside of uh, Adobe Reader, we could then have, show you that all of the layering inside of the PDF, inside of the map is retained inside of the PDF. So we can switch on and off individual layers, switch on tops. Or if we want, we could save it to a PowerPoint. So here we've actually written our map into PowerPoint. Very easily and very quickly, showing you the power and the strength of using Petrosis with Petrel 2017.